Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome to IME Headlines. I am your host. We're getting your top headlines of the day for April 6, 2022. Firstly, Oklahoma passes a near total abortion ban with the threat of prison for providers. The Republican controlled State House of Representatives brought up the bill to vote this week after it was passed last year by the Midwestern State Senate. It now heads to the desk of Governor, Republican Governor Kevin Sitt. First signing. He has signaled his Sid has signaled his support for the anti abortion legislation. If he says he has signed some measure, it would take effect this summer unless blocked by courts. Quote from Tamia Cox, director of the American Civil Liberties Union of Oklahoma. These harmful bills are an alarming reminder of the days of access to safe and legal abortion may be numbered and we continue to fight the guarantee for to guarantee all people have access to essential health care they need, including abortion. Meanwhile, overseas, a Ukrainian zoo may have to euthanize its big cats, bears, and other large predators after Russian shelling nearly destroyed their enclosures. Fieldman Eco- the Fieldman Eco Park issued a statement from its founder on Tuesday saying the park was looking for ways to temporarily house the animals, failing which is only option would be to euthanize them. He said the enclosures are still miraculously retaining their integrity, but would likely be compromised by another round of shelling. The park fears that its predatory animals, including liars, tigers, panthers, jaguars, and bears, oh my, may escape their enclosures and enter the Kharkiv city or nearby villages. It's unimaginably painful to talk about this, but the main priority is now the lives of of the people, Fieldman said. And in interesting news from the science section, the T-Rex arms may have evolved to be short for protection during feeding frenzies. There's a new theory as to why T-Rexes have such short arms. In a new study published in Acta Paleontologia Polonensia, Kevin Padan, a professor of integrative biology and curator at the University of California's Museum of Paleontology, theorizes that the T-Rex's arms evolved to be short as to reduce the chances of accidental dismemberment during feeding frenzies. While it is often assumed that Tyrannosaurids hunted solo, more evidence indicates that many of them may have actually hunted in packs. That being said, when it came to feeding time, the animal's humongous jaws and razor-sharp teeth could do some pretty serious damage to anything caught in its path. Payton suggested his report that during a group of feeding on carcasses, limb reduction was selected to, re- to keep the forelimbs out of the way of jaws and large conspecific predators, avoiding injury, loss of blood, amputation, infection, and death. Ladies and gentlemen, this has been your your high media headlines, your top stories for in five minutes or less. Thank you so much for your support. Consider joining our Patreon at patreon.com slash HIMedia, and I will see you guys tomorrow.